and degree will not be defined if derivative access internal function an equation containing dependent variable independent variable and its derivatives between d and y which is highest number between d and y 3 between d and y 4 so 4 is the highest number order is 4 and order order means what maximum times differentiated term represents order what is order in the whole equation in the whole differential equation derivative should not act as internal function welcome to the session dear students today i am going to start one of the important basic chapter that is differential equations this is one of the basic chapter which helps you to do so many questions in your higher classes understanding differential equations solving differential equations is having wide applications so we'll start with how to find order and degree so first what is differential equation so what is differential equation so in order to start the problems of exercise first we'll see the basics differential equation means an equation containing dependent variable independent variable and its derivatives for example ex equation of the form d power n y by dx power n a 1 in plus a naught into a 1 d power n minus 1 dx power n minus 1 a 2 d power x y a 2 d n minus 2 y divided by dx power n minus 2 so on and constant is equal to 0 where a1 a0 a0 a1 a2 are all constants this is the basic means it should contain dependent independent variable and their derivatives dx dy or t theta like that so now here what is differential equations how to recognize for you people so this is a basic definition to recognize differential equation if you find out d term derivative term then it is differential equation and how to find order and degree order and degree most important order means order means maximum times differentiated term maximum number of times differentiated maximum times differentiated term represents order term represents order maximum how many times we have differentiated we have to observe that represents order its power is degree its power is degree degree three points if i if you make a note from that you can do the whole chapter the first thing how to find order second thing how to find degree third thing when whether degree is defined or not see order and rain order and rain maximum SLR differentiate mode that not called back so maximum times repper differentiated term maximum times differentiated term term represents order represents what order and its power represents degree its power represents what degree degree very important thing is the third point is if 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 derivative acts as internal function d term derivative acts as internal function then degree not defined then degree not defined we can say degree is not defined when can you say degree not defined if derivative is internal now i'll write an equation for example, I'll write dy by dx whole power 5 plus d cube y by dx cube whole square 
plus dy by dx is equal to 5x plus 9. Is this a differential equation? Yes, what I wrote here is a differential equation because it contains derivatives. And order, order means what? Maximum times differentiated term represents order. What is order? Maximum times differentiated term. See here, between d and y, see if we have power 5, here between d and y we don't have number. So this is one time differentiated. Between d and y this is three times differentiated. This is again one time differentiated. Please observe. Maximum how many times you have differentiated you should say dy by dx means one time differentiated and you took power 5 and this is three times differentiated. This is again one time. Maximum we have differentiated three times. So order is 3. What is the order for the problem what I wrote there? 3. What degree means its power. What is its overall power? Its overall power is 2. So degrees 2. Degrees 2. This is a basic. And I will take one more example. Say I will uh, take one more example. So let me consider dy by dx, uh, d square y by dx square plus 3 whole cube, 3 sin dy by dx is equal to 5. Now let me go for order and degree for this. See here, how many times are differentiated? 2 times. Here, 1 time. So clearly for this order is what? Order is maximum times differentiated term. Here only one time here two times. Between d and by 2 means two times derivative. So order is 2. Its power is 3. But degree is not 3 because derivative is acting as internal. Inside sign I have derivative. If, if derivative acts as internal function, degree not defined. So for this not defined. Degree not defined. Now part of you got this. Basics I taught you. What is order? Maximum times differentiated term represents order and its power is degree. And if derivative d term if access internal, if d term is inside sine, cos or log, then degree is not defined. So these are the basics. And you know notations. You know notations. What is y dash? Y dash means dy by dx. Y double dash d square y by dx square. Y triple dash goes on. So between d and y if I write 2 then it is 2 times differentiated. Y double dash means 2 times. Y triple dash 3 times. Okay now without wasting time we will start and solve all the problems of the exercise. Determine so now I will start with exercise 9.1. Determine order and degree if defined. Means if degree exists then you should find of the differential equation given from 1 to 12. So first problem d power 4 y by dx power 4 plus sin y triple dash is equal to 0. Can I write this as d power 4 y by dx power 4 means this is 4 times differentiated plus sin y triple dash. y triple dash means d cube y by dx cube. See maximum how many times differentiated? Here 4 times, here t times. So maximum times differentiated term is order. So order is 4. Between d and y, which is highest number? Between d and y, 3. Between d and y, 4. So, 4 is the highest number. Order is 4. Its overall power, its overall power is 1. So, degree is 1, but here degree is not defined. Why? Because derivative is inside. So, derivative in the whole equation, in the whole differential equation, derivative should not act as internal function. If this is not there, then I would have taken power nothing is there, degree 1 and the bari bodhito. But here derivative is inside. So, degree not defined. Why degree not defined? Degree is not defined because d term derivative is inside the uh, trigonometric function. So if derivative acts as internal function then degree not defined. So answer for this is what? Order is 4. 4 times maximum differentiated and degree not defined. Why degree not defined? Because derivative is inside the function. Next y dash plus 5y equal to 0. Can I write y dash as dy by dx? plus 5y is equal to 0. Order, how many times they have differentiated? dy by dx means they have differentiated between d and y 1. So, one time they have differentiated. And degree, its overall power, its overall power is also 1. dy by dx power 1. 5y, so order is 1 and degree is 1. Then ds by dt, one time they have differentiated d square s by dt square, two times they have differentiated. So, 
order is maximum times differentiated here they have differentiated four sorry only one time so don't get confused so here this is between d and s you should see not the overall so between d and s we have one dsp one time differentiated term it is power four but this is two times so order is two and degree degree means overall power so ds by dt whole nothing is there means you know in maths a means a power one so this is power one so degree is what one order two times differentiated so two power overall power is nothing is there means one d square s by dx square whole square and so this is d y sorry no d square y so now order two times differentiated its power is two degree is not two because inside cos we have derivative first we can write order what is order maximum times differentiated term this is d square y by dx square this is dy by dx so two times we have differentiated here d square y by dx square so this in the problem says order is two but degree degree i can't take this power because inside cos we have derivative if in the whole equation in the whole equation if derivative acts as internal function then degree not defined not defined next d square y by dx square is equal to cos 3x plus sin 3x order means maximum how many times they have differentiated maximum how many times they have differentiated d square y means two times so order is two degree its overall power its overall power what is its overall power so d square y by dx square power nothing is there means degree is one because a means a power one cos 3x sin 3x no problem inside cos or sin you should not have derivative means derivative should not act as internal function here we don't have derivative inside so degree is defined and its overall power of d square y by dx square whole power nothing is there means one so degree is one next y triple dash means can i write it as d cube y by dx cube y triple dash means three times differentiated power two y double dash means what d square y by dx square power three y dash y dash means what dy by dx power four plus y power five is equal to what zero see this is not derivative it is y so now what is order maximum times differentiated term represents order three times here two times here one time here no time here they have not differentiated so maximum three times they have differentiated order is three degree its overall power what is the degree its overall power so power is two so degree is two hope all of you got this there will be one compulsory question in pu board for two marks for order and degree so next y triple dash means what d cube y by dx cube plus 2 y double dash means what d square y by dx square plus y dash means what d y by dx is equal to what zero what is order order means highest times different three times two times one time so three times so order three degree its overall power they have not given d cube y by dx cube only power one so degree one what is order maximum times differentiated term how many maximum times you have differentiated if you have differentiated once one here once twice thrice three times you have differentiated so order is three its overall power is degree and degree will not be defined if derivative acts as internal function next we have y dash plus y is equal to e power x what is y dash dy by dx plus y is equal to what e power x what is order between d and y we have one what is degree overall power that is 1 then y double dash what is y double dash d square y by dx square y dash dy by dx the whole square plus what 2y so what is the order how many times we have uh, differentiated two times what is the degree its overall power its overall power is 1 then y double dash means d square y by dx square Two times y dash. Y dash means what? Dy by dx plus sine y. See, please understand. This is not y dash. Inside sine, we don't have derivative. So order is there. What is order? Two times two. Degree. Many people don't get confused. Degree means overall power. Overall power is one. And inside sine, I don't have derivative. So degree is defined, and it is overall power. Uh, same thing. If you have sine y dash. Y dash means dy by dx. Then we say degree not defined. But here degree is 
defined then so the degree of the differential equation they want only degree see order 2 degree 3 because 2 times differentiated one time so we would have taken order to degree 3 but inside sign I have derivative inside sign if you have derivative then degree is not defined if this is not there then degree would have been 3 order is order always exists order is true but they are not bothered about order they have options they want you to pick what only degree so if derivative acts as internal function then degree is not defined then we have order of the differential equation they want order here two times differentiated here one time differentiated here no time so two is the maximum times differentiated term so order is two order always will be defined in any differential equation so two i hope all of you got this so now i have completed the exercise 9.1 so i'll see you in my next session with solving differential equation this is one of the important chapters please sit and revise and I'll see you in my next session. Thanks for attending. Thank you.